Today on Fixing the Money Thing. What would happen if I told you that you had a treasure chest full of money and didn't know it and it was called the IRS? I don't like the IRS. If the IRS themselves get it wrong 50% of the time, what chance does an average tax guy or a family man have of getting it right? We're talking about taxes on Fixing the Money Thing. With most families burdened in unsustainable levels of personal debt, most Americans believe there is no way to have financial freedom. However, author, pastor, and financial expert Gary Cassie believes most families can be completely out of debt in less than seven years. You must get out of debt. You've got to make right choices with your money right now. Gary and his wife Drenda are now on a crusade to share this information that changed their life so that you can not just survive, but prosper in today's economy. Your life can be totally transformed by an idea in the marketplace. This is Gary Cassie, Fixing the Money Thing. Hey, it's a great day to be alive. Another edition of Fixing the Money Thing, and we're talking about our favorite topic, and that's you and your money. That's right, tax trap. That's what we're gonna be talking oh, yeah. about today. Yeah. Now, Gary, people have all kind of tax issues. Taxes are actually that's even increasing. The, yes, yes. So how yeah. do we save money, and how do we get out of this trap? Well, Drenda, let me ask a question. What would happen if I told you that you had a treasure chest full of money that was able to pay your house off and liberate your family from all kind of financial turmoil and you already had it and didn't know it and it was called the IRS, what would you think? I would think that's shocking since they're taking more taxes. How could there be a treasure chest for us? I think you're right, <laughs> I think you're right. We have some information, some people's opinion on the IRS right now. I don't like the IRS. I'm not a fan of taxes. A lot of undue stress. I, I don't think about the IRS at all. I believe the IRS is the police of the system that the uh, United States uses to tax people. That it's gotten out of control. I don't really have a high opinion of the IRS, but I have not had any problem with the IRS. <laughs> it's an unnecessary evil. Like when you pay for something and then you have to pay more for it. They need to be more accountable. I find it interesting that our income tax is set up as a voluntary system, and yet the IRS has the right to do just about anything that they want to do to get the money from you. I want to have as little to do with them as possible. I think the tax laws are too extensive. People can't understand them. They get afraid of them. Therefore, they don't want to do their own taxes. The IRS is just an organization that has to do you know, their job. As we can see, most people don't have too high of an opinion of taxes or the IRS, but Gary, you say there's a treasure chest in the tax arena. Where is it and how could that be? I know, it's really crazy, and I wanna encourage people, don't turn us off, because this is real. This is real money I wanna tell you about. Let me ask you a question. What is April 15th? April 15th, That's tax when day. taxes are due, right? Right. What's April 12th? I have no idea. <laughs> okay, that's Tax Freedom Day. Now what that means is until April 12th, this is of last year's 2012 taxes, until uh, April 12th, every penny someone makes, gross paycheck, goes to pay taxes. So essentially you're working until April 12th of every year. So from January just to, to pay April 12th, then That's you start, the day you're free from paying taxes. Then you start making money for yourself. Wow. All right. now, and you it's to, probably more for some people since it's increased. Uh, it, yeah, it's probably increased in 2013. So let's talk about this for a second. You'd have to admit that's a lot. It is, okay. definitely. Now, let's dig into this. Since that's so much money that you spend time gathering to pay taxes, what would happen if I told you this question? Okay, first off, someone's going to say, do I have to pay taxes? I mean, that's a lot of money. Well, let's find out what Jesus said first before we dig into the IRS. Let's look at Matthew and pull up a scripture here. In Matthew 20, 22, it says, Tell us then, what is your opinion? Is it right to pay the imperial tax to Caesar or not? And we'll go on 19. Show me the coin Jesus says used for paying the tax. They brought him a Daenerys, and he asked them, Whose image is this and whose inscription? And Caesar's, they replied. Then he said to them, so give back to Caesar what is Caesar's and to God what is God's. So Jesus simply said, hey, if you owe Caesar taxes, pay them. All right. So before we go into this 
finding money thing. I want to make sure we're very clear that we are people who pay our taxes. All right. Now, let's talk about how do we define what we pay Caesar? How do we define that? What do you think? I mean, how do we know how much to pay Caesar? It can be pretty tricky because there's a lot of different laws and regulations. Laws. You said it, laws. Okay, so the laws tell us how much to pay, right? Right. Okay, but that's where the confusion lies because the laws are so complicated that no one, typically the average American, can't figure them out. That's why we have a whole industry of tax preparers because the average person cannot figure this out. So we hire people that can interpret the laws to our situation and tell us how much to pay, right? Right, but even they sometimes disagree. <laughs> You're exactly right, Drenda. In fact, the IRS itself in a study admits themselves that 50% of their advice from themselves is wrong. Wow. In fact, let's show you a graph here. Let's put this graph up of how much do you want to pay. Let me ask you a question. Would you rather pay $6,807 in taxes or $73,247 in taxes? Oh, that's easy. The 6000 okay. <laughs> Now, believe it or not, this is an actual case. Money Magazine did a study and gave the same client's taxes Incredible. to be prepared to 50 different professional CPAs and tax professionals. Not one of the same answer. This is the difference between the 50 professional full-time tax preparers, the difference in the taxes that were due with the same client. Wow, so information is money here, huge. It's huge. huge, yes. Okay, so when I talk about the IRS being a treasure chest, what I'm saying is, Money Magazine says, you're guaranteed, guaranteed after their study, to be paying 25, at least 25% more taxes than you legally owe, and probably 50%. That mm -hmm. was a 10 year study. They did that for 10 years. And after 10 years, not one out of 50 matched. Then they gave full-time tax professionals a 10 question exam, 50 of them. Not one got all 10 right. Well, you can understand what I'm saying. If the IRS themselves get it wrong 50% of the time, what chance does an average tax guy or a family man have of getting it right? What would happen? You saw the big difference, 7,000 to 73. That's enough money to do some good. I Certainly. mean, that's a lot of money. Certainly, that could help families. Exactly. That could do a lot of things, yes. So what I'm saying, the treasure chest is, well, let me, you're, you're a shopper. You're a really good shopper, by the way. Frugal you, shopper, you like yeah. to look for those bargains and you will drive to a store that has a sale on to take advantage of it. Now, let's think of the difference in taxes owed. Most people go to a tax preparer, throw the receipts and everything down in the box and say, here's my taxes. Tell me how much, you know, work it up and tell me how much I owe. Mm -hmm. Based on what we just saw, wouldn't it make sense to have a second opinion? Certainly. I mean, Certainly. if you're going to drive across town to save $100 or a few bucks yes. on sale items, wouldn't it make more sense that something you spend four months of the year paying for that you would take time to investigate and Definitely. to get a second opinion on how Definitely. much you owe? Definitely. That's a, for some people, that's an income, a year's income. Exactly. Definitely. But people don't get a second opinion. People hate to talk about taxes, but we won't talk about it today because this is your money and we want you to have it. And we want you to get out of debt. We are not against the IRS. We're saying you owe taxes. We pay taxes, but let's define how, how much, much we What is legally pay. right. And a lot of people get into trouble with the IRS and afraid of the IRS and afraid to challenge the IRS. But as long as you're talking about the law, then that's all you owe, but you have to define the law. How much do I owe? Let me get a second opinion or maybe a third opinion. But the bottom line is don't take one opinion as the bottom line because we're talking about thousands, enough money to pay for a car, enough money to get out of debt, multiply that over years, you can pay your house off just by knowing how to adjust your taxes. When we come back in just a minute, we're going to talk more about some common sense things that Drenda and I have learned over the years in business. We are not tax people, so I want to say this up front. Anything we say should be checked out with your tax preparer first. 
I'm just giving you some advice, some things that I have seen in 30 years of financial work with families, but some things that have saved people lots of money. When we come back, we're gonna talk about digging in to the treasure chest. To invite Gary to speak at your next event, contact him at GaryCassie.com. Today, from Fixing the Money Thing, tax information you need to protect you, your family, your business, and your money. The Taxpayer's Package is a series of resources designed to teach you how to consistently pay the correct amount in taxes. The package starts with tax expert Dan Pilla's IRS Guide, How to Get Tax Amnesty. There's five or six different strategies that we can use to negotiate with the IRS to reduce or eliminate the debt, but you need to know about these programs and how they work to take advantage of them. Dan Pilla, the executive director of the Tax Freedom Institute, has been tremendously successful in negotiating settlements with the IRS for many, many years. If you owe the IRS, you've got to do something about that because the tax bill typically doesn't just go away. As a nationally regarded expert in IRS procedure, Dan's book has already helped millions find relief from tax debt they were unable to pay. There's something you can do. I don't care what your situation right. is. Yeah. There's right. something you can do. Next, we'll include Dan Pillas, How to Get Tax Amnesty Supplement and Update. In addition to the original book, over a year in the making, this supplement and update covers dozens of changes in the tax code and procedures affecting your rights. The information that you've got here in the supplement gets you right smack up to date with all the latest strategies and rights and remedies that are available. The update describes the current attitude of the IRS and how you can take advantage of it. Part three of the package is Gary Cassie's two CD series, There's Gold in Your Backyard. The kingdom contains hidden treasures and only those who hear his voice will prosper. Gary teaches you how prosperity lies in the fragments others miss, where to look, and when to act. Call, write, or visit GaryCassie.com to order these powerful resources for only $34. To complete the package, for your investment of $59 or more, we'll include Dan Pilla's must-have primer for anyone having to deal with the IRS. The IRS Problem Solver book was ranked by the Wall Street Journal as the number one tax book in America. This book is a comprehensive guide for dealing with the most common IRS problems. These resources will help you deal with the IRS, taxes, and help you fix your money thing. Call 888-391-LIFE. That's 888-391-5433. Go to GaryCassie.com or write to Faith Life Now. The Tax Amnesty Book, the Supplement and Update, in Gary's two CD series, There's Gold in Your Backyard for $34. And add Dan Phillips' The IRS Problem Solver for only $59. Gary Cassie, America's financial coach, wants you to understand taxes, not live in fear of the IRS. And of course, fix your money thing. Order your taxpayer's package of resources today. Would be concerning but I don't really have anything to be concerned about but so you know it's the IRS and I wouldn't get audited I hope because it sounds bad another level of undue stress and trying to figure out where all my paperwork is not real sure never had one as long as I have you know a, a, a seasoned accountant I'm pretty much good to go just a lot of work it wouldn't be a problem for me give to Caesar what's due Caesar I just pay it we're talking about taxes on Fixing the Money Thing. This area of taxes can be very confusing. I know when we first got married, yeah. we thought because we didn't make any income in our business that year that yeah. we didn't owe any taxes and we, we were, had a rude awakening, yeah, we right? We didn't make any net profit, yeah. but we still owed self-employment tax, which right. I didn't even know what that even right. was. Right, so we ended up with penalties and things yeah, to deal yeah, with, but yeah, we've come yeah. a long way and learned a lot of things and a lot of this information helped us too. But Absolutely. What are some of the things, Gary, that we've learned about taxes? Well, let me just give you, let me give you some ideas. Just. Just get your pencil out and let's just talk about the treasure chest. We're going to dig in into the treasure chest and find money. Now, these are just simple ideas. This is just giving you an example of what you can find if you dig. And of course, there's all kinds of books and your professional tax preparer can help. Second opinion, by the way. But you know, you want to gather information. It's just like being sick. No one's going to care about your situation but you the most. So you want to dig and into it. It's worth it. it. You it showed us the big, money is yeah, definitely worth going money. on a treasure hunt here. Okay, so let's talk about a question. How many people you think drive to church and volunteer in the nursery or go help at the church or you a know? A lot of believers do that. Yes. A lot of believers. Including How us. many of them write that off? Probably very few. Probably very few. The IRS 
gives you 14 cents a mile for nonprofit contributions. So if you're gonna volunteer in the nursery, if you volunteer in the nursery every week, let's say you drive 60 miles, let's say round trip, or 60 miles a week to your church and you help mm -hmm. do some things, and you're in a 25% tax bracket, that's a $109 check. Really? It's $109. I mean, you know. So what I'm saying is if you don't take advantage of the in 14 a year cents, or in, a in a year. In a year. Oh, you okay. say, well, that's, that's nothing. Well, if there's $109 laying on the sidewalk, would you pick it up? Certainly. Well, sure you would. It's, I mean, you're already doing it. I mean, you're already doing the driving. It's just a matter of just writing it down and getting your $109, okay? Right. That's just one simple little thing. 55 cents for business mileage. Now, we get into an area here that is big, and that's called having a home business. This is huge. Mm -hmm. A lot of people should have a home business, not even because the business makes a lot of money, but because it gives a lot of tax breaks. For instance, when you have a home business, you can write off part of your utilities, part of your mortgage payment, part of your homeowner's insurance, you know, part of the cleaning supplies, uh, everything you do for the house. And this you can, is perfectly legal. Absolutely, you can take off a percent in, re, in uh, being relative to the size of your office, et cetera, et cetera. And then mileage, if you go to, down to the store to buy some paper and pencils for your business, 55 cents a mile. So all of these things add up. So Having it a pays home to business. have a business, part-time business, Absolutely. have something on the side, plus you're learning some other skills. Absolutely. You have and something make some to money. fall back exactly. on, you make money, hey, but yeah. you also get a huge tax break. It's tax huge, break. it's huge, it's huge. How about this one? Hire your kids. Don't give your kids allowances. Hire them in your home business. The key is when a child's under 18 years of age, you don't have to withhold Social Security taxes. So it's, you don't have to withhold, and unless he makes over a few thousand dollars, usually four or five thousand, I don't know the exact number, you don't have to withhold taxes at all, but you can write it off against your home business. So rather than so, give them the money to go to the movies, there you go. if you have them do some tasks in your business, it has to be appropriate you can to their give age. them some chores, That's exactly right. and you can write a check to them, and then instead of just handing exactly the money to them, right. now it's an IRS deduction. There's a deduction, and little Johnny has his allowance or whatever. And he's he going to the movies or whatever. And he also learns what it's like to work in a business at That's an exactly early age. right. But these things are all, these things are big. This is big write-offs. Sure. Here's a form that literally changed my life. Did you know it's possible to get penalties back from the IRS? I know because we went through it. We yes, went through but it. We didn't know it. Form the time. 843. You can abate penalties. And all you do is fill out why you were late or what the problem How was. How far can you go back? You can go back. You have to file this two years after you've paid the taxes that were owed, and then you get okay. the penalties back. So if you've been owing taxes, say you're behind really bad, and you've been owing taxes for 15 years, if you pay them right That's now, a long time. <laughs> you still have two years. Yeah, after you, you paid it. Years, after you paid that year, you have you two years. It. The once trick you, is you have to pay it all off first. First. And then you then, file this form and they have to give you all the penalties that's back. That's right. Do they have to do that? You're absolutely guaranteed they're going to do it. This is the IRS form that okay. says it. I didn't say it, they did. And what so, reason do they have to give that There's penalty? all kinds of reasons, just tell them the truth. And uh, we did that well, and what, what we got to check What are some of the reasons? Well, I mean. You just didn't I, know, you didn't yeah, have the I money. Yeah, I just didn't you have didn't, the money. I didn't know, I, did, I was late, okay. I had something happen, whatever. And you're going to get and, your penalties back with this form. That's so what they some, said, it I worked for us. I know some people have penalties that have been going a long time. Listen, there's so much to do, we can't cover it here, but. I got pages and pages of things you can do, but we can't do it because we're out of time. But uh, we want you to listen to uh, a CPA who's going to help us right now. He's going to tell us what are the most common mistakes that people make in their tax returns that cost them money. Let's take a look at this. My name is Jerry Frisbee, CPA. I've been doing taxes for about 30 years. And from my experience, most people are paying more tax than they need to. Maybe they're not taking the tuition credit, they may not be taking out. Uh, charitable miles is a good thing. If you, if you volunteer at an organization, you may tra travel thousands of miles uh, to volunteer, and those are oftentimes overlooked by uh, someone that doesn't know what they're doing. The average taxpayer is afraid of the IRS, and that's something that doesn't need to be true. I, as a tax preparer, uh, deal with them on a regular basis, and if you put your problems in my hands, I can alle alleviate that concern for you. You can easily amend a tax return that can save you sometimes hundreds or thousands of dollars in tax. There's only about one or two percent of the people that ever get a face-to-face -face audit, at least on a year-to-year -year basis. So it would really behoove a lot of people to look over what they have done over the last three or 
three years and re-examine it to see if, hey, I've, over, I've overlooked this deduction, I forgot this, I should have had a deduction that I didn't take. Most people are overpaying their taxes, in my opinion. We're talking about taxes. More of today's message in a moment. Today, from Fixing the Money Thing, tax information you need to protect you, your family, your business, and your money. The Taxpayer's Package is a series of resources designed to teach you how to consistently pay the correct amount in taxes. The package starts with tax expert Dan Pilla's IRS Guide, How to Get Tax Amnesty. There's five or six different strategies that we can use to negotiate with the IRS to reduce or eliminate the debt, but you need to know about these programs and how they work to take advantage of them. Dan Pilla, the executive director of the Tax Freedom Institute, has been tremendously successful in negotiating settlements with the IRS for many, many years. If you owe the IRS, you've got to do something about that because the tax bill typically doesn't just go away. As a nationally regarded expert in IRS procedure, Dan's book has already helped millions find relief from tax debt they were unable to pay. There's something you can do, I don't care what your situation right. is, yeah. there's right. something you can do. Next, we'll include Dan Pillas, How to Get Tax Amnesty Supplement and Update. In addition to the original book, over a year in the making, this supplement and update covers dozens of changes in the tax code and procedures affecting your rights. The information that you've got here in the supplement gets you right smack up to date with all the latest strategies and rights and remedies that are available. The update describes the current attitude of the IRS and how you can take advantage of it. Part three of the package is Gary Cassie's two CD series, There's Gold in Your Backyard. The kingdom contains hidden treasures and only those who hear his voice will prosper. Gary teaches you how prosperity lies in the fragments others miss, where to look, and when to act. Call, write, or visit GaryCassie.com to order these powerful resources for only $34. To complete the package, for your investment of $59 or more, we'll include Dan Pilla's must-have primer for anyone having to deal with the IRS. The IRS Problem Solver book was ranked by the Wall Street Journal as the number one tax book in America. This book is a comprehensive guide for dealing with the most common IRS problems. These resources will help you deal with the IRS, taxes, and help you fix your money thing. Call 888-391-LIFE. That's 888-391-5433. Go to GaryCassie.com or write to Faith Life Now. The Tax Amnesty Book, the Supplement and Update, and Gary's two CD series, There's Gold in Your Backyard for $34. And add Dan Pilla's The IRS Problem Solver for only $59. Gary Cassie, America's financial coach, wants you to understand taxes, not live in fear of the IRS. And of course, fix your money thing. Order your taxpayer's package of resources today. With more, Gary and Drenda Cassie. Gary, I like the idea of talking about how to find treasure like yep. you did That's in fun. There's Gold in Your Backyard. That's fun, yeah. And then also these tax amnesty, IRS problem solver. We learned so mm -hmm. much that changed our finances yes. uh, through the years in these books. And I, right here I have someone speaking of their life being changed. Here's a person from uh, North Carolina says, our second mortgage for our rental property was canceled following us becoming your partner, Gary. $38,000 was wiped out, praise God. And uh, they're talking about Team Revolution and that's yes. something you have where people can get this mentorship, right? Yeah, well see the key to Team Revolution is that we have an inner circle, we have several layers of that, but some of this tax information, my heart is mentorship. So I wanna to talk to this business guy and get him information about taxes and other areas of help right. that would help him avoid what I learned the hard way. And so part of the inner circle membership of Team Revolution is to have that kind of help available, uh, you know, monthly conference calls, experts, CPAs, tax people, business people, marketplace ministry people, where they can get advice on situations in real life time that help Excellent. them win in life. Excellent. And so, so it's, it's amazing. You're able to mentor them yes. as well as another group of people you've put together of right. experts. Yes. And they can get their questions answered, yes. get out of their financial dilemma, and then turn around and help someone Everyone else. Everyone should be a part of Team Revolution. Mm -hmm. It's just an amazing thing. Yes, yeah, not to mention you're propagating the gospel. Amen. Which makes Amen. a difference like it did in this person's life. Yes, well, I trust today you take this serious. We've talked about taxes. This is a big deal. There's a lot of money there. 
We are thanking you for joining us today again on Fixing the Money Thing. Get the material. This book got me a refund check by reading it. And you want to get the material. You've got to be diligent about your own affairs, your own life. Go to our website, GaryCassie.com. Get the information. Know this. We are here for you. We are cheering you on. We want to see you win. And we're believing God with you. But every week, every day, we're right here Fixing the Money Thing. Let's get together and let's figure this thing out. And let's fix your money thing. We'll see you next time. Fixing the Money Thing is brought to you by the Ford Financial Group and Lindsay Honda and Acura of Columbus. The purpose of Team Revolution Partnership is to help mentor you in the kingdom principles that have revolutionized Gary and Drenda's life as they share strategies for successful living in your faith, your family, and your finances as you help bless countless others worldwide. As a Life Revolution Partner, with your $20 or more monthly gift, or a one-time gift of $240, you'll receive Gary's brand new book, Kingdom Thoughts, Your Roadmap to a Successful Tomorrow, a monthly teaching letter of encouragement from Gary, a personalized get-out-of-debt plan, a 10% discount on all Faith Life Now resources, the new insightful Power of Partnership CD to release you into a new level of success in 2013, and much more. Call toll-free 888-391-5433. Go to GaryCasee.com or write to Faith Life Now and partner with Gary Cassie to change your life while changing lives around the world. When you need God's help, prayer is always the answer. Pastor Gary understands and wants to help. That's why he has caring friends standing by, ready to pray with you. No matter what you're facing, there is hope. Call and let's agree together. Caring prayer partners are available faithfully Monday through Friday from 9 to 6.30. You can also leave your prayer request at GaryCassie.com. Just click and know someone will be agreeing with you in prayer for your need to be met. Call or log on today. Want to know more? Read and comment on Gary's blog. Partner with Faith Life Now. Find out where Gary and Drenda are speaking. Send us your prayer requests. Order more life-changing resources. Find out what's happening at the NOW Center. Invite Gary to speak at your church or event. Watch archived Fixing the Money Thing episodes. All these things and more are waiting for you at GaryCassie.com. Tune in each Friday at 5.30 p.m. for Drenda. Connect with special guests, discover life-changing topics, and learn to live life out loud. It's more than just television. It's Drenda. Gary Cassie is excited to share the message of kingdom principles with all who will hear. If you have one experience with the kingdom, it will change your life forever. To invite Gary to speak at your next event, contact him at GaryCassie.com. Come experience Faith Life Church for yourself and become a part of a close-knit gathering of people who want something more. More impact, more purpose, more of God, more of life. Located on the east side of Columbus, just 10 minutes from Easton off 161, Faith Life Church meets in the Now Center with services Saturdays at 6 p.m. and Sundays at 9.30 and 11.30 a.m. Come experience the good life at Faith Life Church. Partner with Gary. Check out GaryCassie.com for more info. Fixing the Money Thing is brought to you by the partners and friends of Faith Life Now.